is rashni hana dramatic girl. Okay. Mtu anapenda drama sana. Okay, au au sijui nitajibu aje. Tuseme bas kukua kwa mahusiano mimi na yeye ndio ilikuwa inaleta drama. Sometimes inani inaniumiza juu na scroll pale napata tu watu wa screen record wengine ni tag maybe right now she's happy i don't know welcome to bed palace kenya home of quality affordable and luxurious beds we have also diversified to classic sofas visit our showroom in vindigwa kiambu road opposite quick mart as well as roy sambu thika road contact us on 0725 414842 bed palace the ultimate solution to insomnia Hello guys this is Mr a lot more you are senior Udaku reporter and of course a lot more is coming i am coming to you live from nyumbani mtwangu this is the first ever interview kufanyia hapa nyumbani mtwangu na ukiona inafanywa nyumbani basi jua ni specially kivyake mtwangu today i am here to speak to have a conversation with young blood Kamodo anaitwa Damu Mbichi kijana ni mbichi kabisa anasumbua wasichana wasichana wanamtafuta na hako hapa leo kutupa story story following the drama that happened msicheke nikisema story mutulia following the story that happened sometimes last year wakakuwa na drama online mambo yakakimbia wakaachana wakarudiana wakaachana tena and today is here to give the whole story ilianzaje ikaishaje sasa hivi wako pamoja ama washaachana and guys this episode is proudly sponsored by bed palace kenya bed palace kenya is kenya's number one bed seller ama supplier ukitaka kitanda tu kizuri ulale vizuri wa void zile back pains ulale vizuri na watu wako na mke wako rafiki zako pale nyumbani your girlfriend your loved ones enda pale bed palace thindigwa kiambu road ama pale resambu thika road utapata kitanda kizuri and of course we have something big coming up very soon call the number that is on your screen uh, then place your order after five working days kitanda chako ama kiti chako kitaletwa nyumbani mtu wangu kamodo yuko hapa ametulia kabisa kamodo inakwaje mzee kwa salama <laughs> The last time tulikuwa nayo wapi by the way kwa last time tulikuwa nayo ni nakuru na birthday ana benta ya juzi juzi tu ya 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 umekuaje lakini nimekuwa best Mungu anasaidia mm uko vizuri kabisa uko vizuri siku zote mm damu ni mbichi eh changa oh si mbichi ni changa young blood damu changa damu changa yako ni changa eh unao zitano anakufuata sana Ah uh, ni fuati mimi ndo nafuata. Eh. Mm. It's the other way. Tunafuatana. Eh. Eh. Ni sawa basi. Kama dho. Yeah. Mhm. Watu wamepotea wame sana online it's been a month hatujakuwa na uki post anything. Umekuwa wapi kwanza? Ongea na watu ndio hiyo kamera hapo. Oh ile ndio kamera yangu. Oh so like nilijipe break for one month. Um actually since TikTok sijapost kitu kitu kwa February date 4. Si Julian ni March date dad so like unaona hiyo dini mwezi mzima kwa nimejipe break nilikuwa tu nafanya fanya mambo zangu chini ya mama chini ya wabling chini ya maji eh, lakini sasa nimerudi so ulikuwa umenitafuta nikakwambia nikirudi nitakutafuta but now i'm officially back na ndio maana nimekutafuta mm. perfect kamodo why are you doing this interview today oh like this is something i always wanted to do since last year al uh, actually end of last year but nilikuwa na jipe two time like nilikuwa na take to my own time siko na pressure like wasi wengi walikuwa na feel i have to address and everything but siko nataka ku, kuenda na venye wasi wana feel or like nilikuwa nataka kufanya ile siku nita feel now i need to speak it out i want to clear out my name because uh, last year sijui ilikuwa october ama ni november kuna vitu nili accusiwa off and um, i feel like it's the right time i address it now mm. eh. so you are here to talk yeah i'm here to talk yeah. yes good 
Yes, guys, Kamodo is here. Amesema ah, tatashapiga kinywaji mtu wangu. Hiyo inaitwa 0%. Unajua? Jaiza. Hii ni gani flavor gani? Ni 0%. 0%. Yeah. Kuna ini ito... tumetengenezwa wenyewe hapa nyumbani. Oh, yeah, imetengenezwa na mamiz. Yeah, that's what tunaita ati <laughs> Sinasikia una mita mamiz. <laughs> <laughs> that's what tunaita 0%. Sinasikia ni percentage 0. Yeah. Sasa tutaanza kuweka percentage 5 4 but when mtu anajua anajua unapiga ma 40%. Ah. Wewe kama wewe ukunyo? No. Ukunyange pombe. Mm. Ah. <laughs> uh, mineral water. A yeah. 0%. Yeah. I wish mungajua hii 0% ni <laughs> Young blood kamodo. Tuanzie wapi mzee basi. Hebu tupe story last time. The last year kulikuwa na drama whereby you are accused of cheating, sijui nini, yes, by your threesome, by your ex-girlfriend, uh, Nihan, Rash Nihan. Tupe story mzee tu tupe mahali ilianzia mpaka mahali ilishia. Okay, so like mimi nitasema um it was um, last year nilikuwa nimekutafuta actually i will have to mention this because it was also mentioned na julie ulisikia jina yako hapo ndani na ya wambo so i will make it clear so tulikuwa tunafaa twende nakuru tulikuwa tuna relocate to nakuru so wewe unajua nilikutafuta because uh, pesa zangu zetu by then tulikuwa tuna work pamoja zikuwa zinaingia the next week so i approached kioko nikamwambia tupige boost then uh, do it drop tutakurudishia of which we did nilisikia ilikuwa ya mentioned pale ndio maana i had to make it clear so we had to relocate to nakuru juu tulikuwa tunaamua tujificha kidogo plus pia tulikuwa tuna work huko hivyo na a certain brand stay mention so we had to relocate um unfortunately hiyo siku tu tume relocate my grandma kapas so um venye tuli relocate ya yeah, alikuwa anafaa in the home actually ni venye hiyo safari tu ndo ilikuwa ime but after tume relocate ilikuwa that week aende atembee nyumbani but hakuishia sababu my grandma alipas so it kaanza naona kwenda maombolezi na tulikuwa tuna drive from nakuru tukuitu ilikuwa nyeri so after we sasa tulisika shosh sasa um, akatembea home akaenda sasa kwa mama yake sasa so sasa hapo ndo mambo ilianza sasa um, akiwa huko actually we were not in good terms sasa kwa tunasikizana kulikuwa tuna ma story ni nini ni nini ni, ni. juu kulikuwa na mabishti hapa katikati walikuwa nampea some information So because there is a time sim niko na kuru nilikuwa nimekuja Nairobi na yeye akua so like how anamwambia mbia ma staff ma staff hivi so the day she was coming back actually that day ni sasa na rudi ndio ileta mambo sasa because i was talking with a uh, kuna client nilikuwa naongea na yeye na kumbuka alikuwa wa outside the country alikuwa wa Zanzibar alikuwa ananiambia nataka kujua mambo ya forex juu but then i was working with a certain forex uh, school so venye alirudi sasa ametoka home amekuja sasa amerudi we were not talking so mean venye nilipigiwa simu uh, nikaenda kushikia simu nje but i was just talking with that it was, she was a lady i was talking with the lady about forex but nikaenda kushikia simu nje now that's when the camera came that's when sasa nilimona amekuja na camera so starudia juu wasi wengi waliona pale TikTok sasa kuja akasema first alisema ati i cheated with a dem flani ya pili akasema naenda threesome of which i make sense pia kwa hiyo okay if hadi ningekuwa napanga threesome sidhani ni kitu mbaya nitsemi hadi ningekuwa napanga threesome singepanga ati niende mimi kijana mwingine na msichana mmoja but kwa hiyo inso kwa hiyo kwa ungependa ikuaje ah ah nasema <laughs> si ati ningependa ikuaje nasema like sasa kwa hizo stories ni alikuwa napewa juu ni story alikuwa napewa ya kwanza sema ambao ni cheat ya pili akaambia napanga kwenda threesome mimi bishi yangu fulani um i will say an ex friend you we don't talk like that and um na nini nyingine niliacha na dem moja sasa zin 23 some maboy wawili dem moja so hapo sasa akakuja na hiyo information so hiyo ndo nilitusiwa nayo sana akanitusi 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 but you know my mom raised me well mimi sisi anza kubishana na msichana ama 
and it all led drama na mipia ni mtole drama you know I'm a man so nili walk out kwa hiyo incident now after camera imefungwa sasa kila mtu aliachiwa hapo mimi sijawahi ongelea hiyo story tena sijai sema if ni kweli i cheated sijai sema if hiyo drisa milikuwa ama haikuwa as in venye Kenya yali sema ndo in stand out till today so this is now the where the story begins after all that incident sasa of course we had dated for almost a year sije kati tulikuwa tumefikisha mwaka i guess tulikuwa tumefikisha but we were almost definitely lazima tungeongelea about it of which i can say we solved the issue because akukwa na kitu kama hiyo na iliisha mzee na iliisha because zilikuwa story alikuwa amepatiwa tu na wasiu pia sisi wawili tuliwa cut off because hiyo story ilikuwa tu made up stories I never cheated. I can look at the camera and say I never cheated and she knows it. I never cheated. Your story in fact ilisha na day one. None yo siko yenyewe ni not. Sasa from the next day hadi hiyo ikienda Nairobi gossip ikienda everywhere. Iki trend everywhere. Nikifanya videos also nenda hadi kwa past videos zangu kuni tu si kuni tita you will never see. Yani matusi zingine deadly deadly. As in nilikuwa tu na zi receive tu nikijua like i never did this thing like wasepi ya wengi wananiambia young blood nini nini unafanya nini but siko yongelea but i never cheated akukua na kitu kama hizo in short all those were made up stories so nilitusua bore like nilitusua bore na hiyo story to resolve na ikaisha na day one imagine it was that very night ndo hiyo story like to leave Maliza like because i never cheated na mkaendelea kuishi pamoja okay like now tukajaribu ku solve sasa like sasa unajua that was a it was a big thing it was not just a small thing because like ingekuwa ni vita za pale nyumbani of which aziko sangi unajua hata mkisolve so after there kuna venye tu life ilibadilika kidogo and um kwanza that was the main thing like i feel free like nimitoa like ndani yangu i'm not a cheater bro tunenanga no bish tanka juzi tulikuwa na huko Lavington Molibiza sijui kama unajua kwa Ibiza na patananga na wasi everywhere tumekuwa nyururu tumekuwa embu at in fact nikitoka hapa na kimbia embu tumekuwa na kuru na ivasha places mob na patananga na fans wangu waniambia hata kama you cheated au uko na deserve you, like we still love you and everything like me na feel vibaya like wasi wana niona chita like wanajaribu kunionyesha we still love you hata kama uli cheat sasa hiyo mimi siku cheat but nimekaa tu nayo like ni kitu imekuwa tu ndani yangu since that very day i never cheated i never cheated she knows that hakuna drisam kama hiyo ilikuwa hakuna mambo kama hiyo ati nimeenda ku cheat so in short ni letu si yangu tu boring that something in nani ilikuwa tu ilikuwa tu mzito tu ndani yangu yeah i feel good nimeitoa tu ndani yangu and my fans at least wanazajua Young blood Kamodo is not a cheater. I never cheated. Yeah. There is a time there is a time I came in Nakuru na kwenye tulienda kuna kaa kitengela. Na maanisha tulichafuka sana miguu. So nilitaje mahali niende ni nani nioge miguu ni kuwe msafi at least and you offered me your place nikakuja. Actually I didn't expect kupata ni yani kwako but niliwapata mko pamoja mnatulia mnacheza nini at that time ulikuwa mshasa watu vitu mko sawa kabisa yeah i mean like after after the incident unajua definitely tulikuwa tume date for a long time and yetu ilikuwa imefika hadi kwa wazazi so there is no way tungeachana tu rais unaona especially the fact that um sikuwa nimechit yes hata kama nilikuwa na feel uzito ndani yango like need to see bore and stuff and yo kwaibishwa yote and stuff like tulikuwa tusha soul tulikuwa poa yeah i can say tulikuwa poa time unakuja as in tulikuwa tu poa kabisa okay you you guys are not together as we speak yeah yeah since last year when break up ilifanyika leni sasa the official one now um as i say sasa tulipart ways vizuri christmas hiyo time ya christmas eh yeah. what happened Uh, now let me let me look to the camera and see <coughs> actually unajua wasi wengi hawezi expect <coughs> but me na nihan to break very peaceful in fact i can tell you my words since i've been she knows that i told her 
I want you to eat, I want you to glow, I want you to shine, I want you to do a lot of videos. Bro, nilimuangaleni kamambia all these things. Like, nilimuambia, it was very peaceful to look at to make a two pamoja. Nilikuwa na mambia like, sasa sasa tukua tuna end things. I'm not a petty person, I'm not a, I'm not that dramatic guy or anything. Ama sijua ni tangwa bitter, wase bitter, ama nini. She knows that. I told her I want you to shine. Juzi hata veni liona mefanyafanya collabs na some people. I was tagged of course. Nikangalia and I said yes. Even I told my friend this is what I wanted to say. Like pia yana jua. I told her I want you to do a lot of videos. I don't. Nilimambia hata in a day. Post a lot of videos. Eat. She knows that I told her I want you to shine. Juzi nilimambia. Hakuna venye mungu wali kuumba. Then I can make like young blood peke ndio. Atiko hii dunia niye peke aneza kumake happy. So I told her. I want us to part ways like if we got two point to look on a lot of differences the little care so to cap out is too very peaceful yep no na kwa sababu huyu ni mtu ambaye amekaa na for quite some time i remember wakati mlianza kudeta was the first person kwa fanya i did an interview with you pale ka sukari ukaniambia unamtaka nini nihan rush nihan ni mtu aina gani of cameras ni, ni, ni mtu wa ina gani kimapenzi nini of course we had a lot of memories um, and kila msiana kuanga tu kuna uzuri wake kuna ubaya wake kuna as in kuna tu vitu mingi so like but she, she was a good person so kuja nisemeze nini nini mimi nalalanga na the good thing tunaambia ngo ataka mtu amekufanyia mabaya aje sisao ile kitu moja hapo alikufanyia ma some good thing she did, she ama mse alikufanyia so niza sema to overall tuseme been good ilikuwa inalalia mabaya yake tuseme mm. perfect hiyo october wakati some v- story ilikuja online muka akakutusi akakusi story za three sam cheating yeah. i mean wakati hiyo kitu ilianza ku trend because maybe you didn't know ana record vitu kama hizo i mean ulichukuliaje wewe how what came in your mind ulikuwa na feel aje um unajua, unajua funny thing when you are in love with a person ndo maana nasema kitu mzuri inalalia inakuanga na uzito kuliko the bad thing so in fact actually after hata kama hiyo kitu yote tukio tu wili tukasema we will know how we will deal about it as in iko na nipe okay mi kwangu ilikuwa inaniumiza because i had not cheated and hakuna uh, kitu nilikuwa nimefanya but same because back then i was in love so like nilikuwa tu tutajua vitu tuta deal nayo mso si kwa na ile do ilikuwa sometimes inani inaniumiza juu na scroll pale na pata tu watu wa screen record wengine ni tag so definitely na nikumbusha as in joy taishi taishi tu kuiona for life but tuseme nilikuwa tu sina stress jo nilikuwa najua one day we will deal with it ya yeah. alisema pia hauna pesa pesa zinatafutangwa i mean sita kuja hapa nianze kusema vitu zingine pesa zinatafutangwa but you know back then tulikuwa tunatafuta pamoja and of which i think I would advise um, people who are dating ama if you want to date tafuta pesa kama mimi sasa hivi nikitaka ku date sidhani naweza tu siwe hivyo tena eh oh sha tafuta pesa as in uh, unajua when you are dating i was serious si ndio i was in a serious relationship so definitely pesa tulikuwa tunatafuta pamoja so kama ni mimi nimeleta hii lazima itaishia nyumbani as in itaishia so sita kuja hapa nianze kuongea ama kujaribu ku clarify some things whatever she said me i will just say i did not cheat hata kama sina pesa kuna mmoja atakuja kunipenda kama sina hiyo pesa good uh, during that scenario as a man i know some part of you died that particular moment kuna vitu vingi mingi zilisemwa na hata zingine hatuwezi sema hapa i mean is it true that some part of you kamodo died hiyo siku ukapata kuna tu kitu fulani yako imetoka tuna imepotea hivyo yeah the fact that i had trusted her a lot the fact that no when you're in a relationship set ya ana weaknesses zake tuseme ama some things or like some stories or like anything but the fact that you will trust somebody then maybe ana kutusi tu like yani in kwanza kwa camera like in, yani kwanza 
kamera unajua mimi um tusaito leana drama na pia back then when we were in Dika, but it was off camera so like e ili ilini ilini toa tu ile ku trust msi tu rais like unaweza kuwa tunamsi but one day ujua anaweza kuja kukufanyia nini ama ujui extend me kisi kwa idani yangifika that extend so after there and nilijua never think like a easy i happen itakuja tu ku happen as in unaweza kuwa tunamsil but the next day too ko like wa yani so because at some time we were chilling with her and i'm like na mwangalie hivi nakumbuka tu whatever she did that day and like um wa si jui expect nini tena ya so tuseme nili kitu ya ku trust yangu ndio ile ile decrease to perfect uh come on umezungumzia about drama nini i mean is rashni hana dramatic girl ni mtu anapenda drama sana okay au au sijui ndio aje tuseme hivi tukiona yeye hatunge make hatunge make kukua tuseme bas kukua kwa mahusiano mimi na yeye ndio ilikuwa inaleta drama hata ni yeke hivyo tuseme mimi kukaa na yeye lazima kungetokea tu drama sijui drama inatokea wapi but as long as we were together tuseme ndio drama tu ingetokea so it was good for both of us to part ways so the answer is yes yeah both of us chani niseme oh. both of us you are also dramatic acha niseme nime acha niseme as long as we are together ndio drama ingetokea so it was good for both of us to just quit yeah sitaki ilale na side moja sitaki mm. okay sawa sawa basi kamoto sahi umesema mliachana peacefully aja kutafuta maybe akwambie mreconcile nini hatutafutani hanitafuti simtafuti in fact i want to make this clear if somebody is unajua wase wengine ask my friend here hata madi mengine tuseme tuko place unasikia kiniambia nyia mwezi achana or something or something or something wengine hadi wanakuchanga instagram wananiambia stop hiding your relationships juu nini 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 we are very sing mimi oh mimi i'm single now we are not dating we don't talk we have never talked this year we have never the whole year kutoka yeah. kutoka first january yeah. up to date uh it was uh um there was just once uh i had a question nilikuwa namuliza because the previous house tulikuwa tunakaa walikuwa amenitumia tuli tulitoa vitu zetu huko but wakanitumia juu nyumba ni mimi nilikuwa nimekana jina yangu wakanitumia wakaniambia niko na dunia 60k or something so ndo nikamuliza hey like mbona hao wanani call wanani text wananiambia hivi akaniambia ajui but we have never talked at hey how are you doing or like how is like, hata salamu i swear on god ataka spend i swear so si mpigi msalimi ya saibasi i'm good i'm good i'm very good you're not at broken i'm not nili heal last year ndo ifike hadi point tunakuja ku part ways mimi nilikuwa nili heal kitambo like nili heal tu kitambo so nikajiambia even nikiingia this year acha tu nitafute pesa yeah ni pesa sasa hii sasa mm. eh, mapenzi kikataa mtu utafuta pesa by the way <laughs> kama ndio inasemekana mama wa US wanakupenda sana ama ni wana wapenda tunapendana sana they are good people they do encourage me Uh, wako wengi um, they do encourage me so tuseme tu tunapendana sisi wote they are nice people mm. sawa so, sawa so, mambo iko best in the world the next girlfriend that utakuwa naye utamleta kwa mtandao utamweka kwa channel if i have maybe if i have na mjui ama na hawajui ama kama sina na nitakuja kupata ndakuja na yake ona ball si waletei tu mtu the next person i'm dating or if i'm dating if we are coming kwa social media lazima ni chape twins eh <laughs> <laughs> twins <laughs> na hizi stories za mzungu ati uko na mzungu siku hizi nini uh, ni za ukweli bro mimi najitafutia so this ni mzungu golf dem yako oh dem yangu mzungu eh hey, i wish <laughs> this na mimi nataka local mimi nataka hawa wetu. Nataka ngozi nyeusi. Nataka ngozi kama yangu bana. Eh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, kabisa bana.
hizo vitu zote zako the drama between you and Neha nimekufunza nini kama mwanaume nimefunza tafuta pesa um mtaheshimika pia mimi nifunza um, the drama unaongelea hiyo drama sasa hey, mimi nifunza tu in short with money you can have what you want and awezi haribiwa jina hivi hivi and i will get what i want with money mm. ali regret yo kitu nihan yeah of course yeah we are back then now when we were together after sasa tumi solve because alikuwa anaona pia ilikuwa ina ni affect because sometimes alikuwa anaona nilikuwa napitezo videos bro nilikuwa natagiwa mbaya ama some comments unajua ama naingia live unapata in fact hata sikuingia live for a long time but hata hiyo time nakuja kuingia live unapata tu matusi ilikuwa mob ya yeah, so back then maybe right now she's happy i don't know mm. okay given a chance unaweza kumrudia nope amtaki kabisa I'm good. Mm. Perfect. Kawe na kawe ume uko vizuri wewe. Ko best in the world come on though. <coughs> What is the next pray? Eh? <laughs> Nyama next ni gani? Nyama next. Dem. Ana na plan kupiga next sasa. Kupiga. Mjeledi ama. Ama na manisha nini ukisema asini ku. When I'm too of course unapenda master master hivi. Nanyo na crashia sana. Mimi there's a mata kama ni bibi ya mtu usiogope. There's a good strategy so nilinibamba sana kisha na MMG kuwaletea mtu wa muexpect mtu wa mjai guza guza huko mkidance dance na yeye ama Mr. Kiawasi wame wamekuwa na two boys boys tote tu amta unaona kishon hivyo vinya alienda out of the blues anatuletea mtizedi maybe niangukie Rwanda ama South Africa tena nitafute wa huko ni kwa advice kuna unaona UK UK kuna warembo mzee najua najua UK kuna warembo mm. mama le safi wameiva kama maembe naangalia ukambani <laughs> oh wakamba i've never dated a kamba mm-hmm. mm. let's try utafute mkikuyu kama wewe mkikuyu ni shaikuwa na yeye eh. eh. anaitwa njeri um alikuwa anaitwa aje unajua mimi yani hata ukumbuki jina chekumse <laughs> okay nilikuwa nimezoea kumuita princess sasa nilisahau jina yake niko na mjoke oh alikuwa anaitwa Keshi mm. wangeshi mm, kitu kama hiyo mm. eh una ex wangapi kwa ni mm. eight um, dosi wengi sana but si wakumbuki mimi nikisonga nimesonga ah ina five by the way mimi hata ex wangu hata si kama ana exist kasi hata sio watu anyway Sasa <laughs> sasa kama the YouTube narudi wen YouTube a very good project nilisikwa nimepotea tu bure as in for one month and um, I have a good project soon itakuwa on their screens wafike pale young blood kamodo fika pale young blood kamodo subscribe tuko road to 80k subscribers so kama uja subscribe make sure you subscribe Perfect. Thank you so much Kamodo. Waja sasa tuende tutafute Neha na tupatie sedi yake story. Mambo chemuke. Si ndio? Yeah, she cheat. Um sijui but for me I'll say no. From my own knowledge, nikiona eh mimi naweza sema no but unajua mimi si Mungu. Of course hadi uki kama wewe si sijui mambo yako nitajua tu vile Kenya naona of course but from my own knowledge she never cheated or like any signs that could cheat. Nope. And uh, I wanted to say one thing. Please. Now that I'm back. The reason nearly go underground. Actually my friend was very mad at me. Just just post anything for one month. We've been going to nice places, Naivasha, Lake Naivasha Resort ulikuwa huko actually at the time ya Valentines, but nilikuwa tu nataka wasiwa ni sahau. Like I will say this when i'm doing my own videos sasa nikianza life yangu nikianza kutesa or like nikianza kufanya anything i own no one an apology i never cheated i never cheated to leave breakups you know some says kuje kuniambia 
hukufanya poa kuacha so and so or something ama nikiingia live i'm living my own life mzanze kuniambia like ama kunimentionia some other names and also pia mimi ni sikuwe mentioned places zingine ama kutagiwa places zingine we both moved on so i think it's time for even our fans very respectfully pia wao wa move on nilikuwa nataka hiyo pressure hii tulie sababu i was just doing videos hadi yote nimeenda nyaruru tukao tumeenda ma vacation tukao tunatembea i was starting to record videos tukitembea na uko subuki ama high points ni nini in fact nilitaka ku record sababu everything i'm doing inakaa ni kama ni competition so I decided to go underground nilikuwa tunatesa kidogo kidogo pale wa substate as others ya kwani kishoot kitu have been going to nice places places na za shoot my own contents vizuri but si kwa na shoot sababu na join ta shoot wasi wanze kunimentionia ama wasi wanze kuniambia vitu zingine now because ni mimi clear i will really appreciate if now niache sasa niishi maisha yangu sasa nikiwa any place I mean case on yone na mtu nime shoot maybe collaboration na mtu ama wasikie nilikuwa na fulani ama ni rekodi unajua siku hizi kamera zimejaa kila pali ni rekodi maybe nikiwa na msio or like living my own life nisikumbushwe ni, ni about my past nisha move on so i also want them to move on and that's why before nianze ku post nianze sasa ku post back now on my nini i feel it akuwa poor because i want to interact with my fans pale kwa comment section ndomana ni ndomana ni ma respect ngoja nimwambia because I, i never cheated or acti kufanya anything else to move on nisitajwe na mimi pia nisitaji nisitajiwe kila mtu aishi maisha yake yes come others urging you all sasa yasha move on ni hana sha move on kwa hivyo pia sisi ma fans to move on aliyopita sindwele tungange jayo nanya alisema hivyo Mtuangu. Thank you so much guys for watching. Mkoa nikipiga story na Young Blood Kamodo amesema damu ni changa, amesema hakuwa cheat, amesema sasa yuko single na pia yuko sokoni. Wamama wanampenda, pia yeye anawapenda mtu wangu. He is coming back on YouTube bigger and more bigger. Thank you so much guys for watching. Mambo ni mengi, muda ni mchache. For now it is a bye bye. I will see you on the next one.